Hello, Facebook and YouTube. Just wanted to drop a quick video. Um, I'm dropping this video because this morning I noticed a post from one of our friends that we know personally. Really good guy. Um, the work that he does is to benefit children and low-income families. Just a, a generally good person as far as we can see. Also a Christian guy. So he simply made a post this morning stating that... He was not bothered by Kamala Harris's indiscretions that she's being attacked on. He said that what bothered him was that during that time of her indiscretions with Willie Brown, she was appointed to two positions for which she was paid six figures and showed up to about two meetings per month in order to receive that money. His main thing was us knowing what's going on with our tax dollars. And everyone just came out, oh, I like her, I love her, you're so bad, you're a white man, you're privileged, blah, 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 blah. Literally, the man said nothing about her character. He said nothing disparaging about anything that she did in her past. But he just said that we need to be looking at what is going on with our tax dollars. He said that we need to hold these politicians accountable for how they're spending our money. And everybody just went nuts. And at the end of the day, you know, the last thing that I um, posted in my replies to these mainly women, um, about three or four of them just posting hundreds of um, responses or replies on there or whatever. My main thing was, I don't want those types of folks to vote. I don't want them to vote because if you're going to be that uninformed and you're going to vote, that is dangerous. In my opinion, an uninformed constituent is more dangerous than the politicians that they vote for because they're going to be blind. They're going to be led blindly, just like these politicians. This is what I'm going to end with. I mean, these um, constituents that believe the hype that Donald Trump had children in cages Looking at pictures from the Obama administration, the cages that they built, the pictures of the children that were there during his term, this was never covered. This was never, ever addressed. It's like the Democrats do something and then they say, oh, Donald Trump did it. Russia, Russia, Russia. Oh, Don we were me on video. I have been accused of being a Russian bot on this very channel that my husband, we've been accused of being Russian bots because we're black Trump supporters. And I guess it's just unbelievable. But I'm going to say this in closing. There's going to be a rude awakening again come November 3rd when all of these folks vote for Donald Trump again. A lot of them did it back then. A lot of Democrats People that we know that, that contacted us and were like, you know, um, I'm encouraged, I'm a Democrat, but I'm voting Donald Trump. But they're not bold enough to say it because folks like the people that went on this gentleman's post today just come out of the woodworks and they want to attack you. And honestly, you know, I'm praying for him with his job that maybe someone he's friends with at work didn't see this post and just take it way out of context and accuse him. I mean, he was being accused. He was being talked about as being a white man and this is the way he thinks, obviously, blah, blah, blah. And he's someone that literally serves families of color a lot. And we know this factually. Anyway, you guys, I just wanted to drop that. And again, you know, like I said, we don't want those folks voting at all. We hope that they don't vote at all if they are going to be the type that don't want to know what's going on with tax dollars. They don't want to know what's going on with policies. They just hear Donald Trump bad, hate Donald Trump. This is what we're going to do. We're going to hate him. Or they're just going to vote. And I don't, you know, from what I could see, maybe some of the people on this post were black. I don't think so, though. I don't even think that these women that were attacking him were even black women for the most part. I think that most black folks in the black community um, have been disillusioned with her on a lot of levels for a, a number of reasons. But anyway, you guys, God bless y'all. And please subscribe to our channel. Um, it will help us get a larger platform on YouTube so that we can get our message out. Thank you so much and God bless y'all.